There's not a friend like the Holy Jesus. No, not one. No, not one. Why, how this sweet potato? Thank you for stopping by for a spell. Y'all always kindly brighten up this old arcade. Oh, and grab yourself a handful of them jelly beans if you like. They sure is pretty, ain't they? All the colors of the rainbow. Sweeter than honey. Kind of like God's Word. And speaking of God's Word, I was thinking on my Bible just this morning. What Paul says over there. For if he who comes preaches another Jesus, whom we have not preached, or if you receive a different spirit, which you have not received, or a different gospel, which you have not accepted, you may well put up with it. 1 Corinthians 11, 4. And Jesus says to Philip over the heart, John 14, Jesus said to him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Like the other day, I was sitting on a park bench feeding the ducks and birds uh, with the cornbread I had from dinner the night before, kind of reading my Bible. Well, directly this sweet old lady sits down next to me, and believe it or not, I don't think she seemed to know the size of a grizzly bear. Oh, really? Well, now she was wearing them uh, thick glasses, so that might have had something to do with it, you know. But uh, she uh, asked me, why are you Christians always talking about Jesus being the only way? Ain't there other ways to God, too? I just grinned real big at her and said, You know, ma'am, you look like you may have been a school teacher at one time. And she allowed that she had been taught third grade. I said, ma'am, did you ever let your kids read comic books instead of textbooks? After all, they's a lot more interesting, and they got all kinds of colorful pictures inside. Well, she commenced to laugh and pound her cane on the ground. She said, That's the silliest question I ever heard. And I said, Well, it is, isn't it? And I pulled out my bag of jelly beans here, offered her some. She politely took a couple. And I said, Now, ma'am, if one of your kids in your classes was sick, and you sent him to the school nurse, and she gave him jelly beans instead of medicine, because why they sweeter and prettier, wouldn't you think that was kind of a hoot, too? Well, she laughed and said, I see your point, Mr. Bear. It takes the right pill to do the right job. And I said, it's the same way with Jesus. He's the onlyest way to God the Father in heaven. Well, then I asked her if I could recite her little poem I done wrote. She said, sure. Got out a notepad and wrote it down. You might want to remember it yourself sometime. Jelly beans is pretty, but they won't cure our ills, even though they sweeter than some doctor's nasty old pills. And it's the same with Jesus, when our soul is sick within. A fake God who just might please us can't save us from our sin.